morning guys and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to vlogmas well i'm obviously not doing vlogmas every day i'm doing it like kind of once twice a week so i'm just kind of winging it but i'm actually off to vista village today oh my god annoying <laughs> ignore this mess behind me i've got to like clean the house but yeah i'm actually off to vista village today i just need to quickly put my hat and lippy on because i am running late as per usual so I'm just about to hop on the tube and then meet the girls at the Marlborough Station because we're actually checking out a new cafe there that's opened. And I'm sure you guys will probably be familiar with it when I show you. And obviously do a little bit of shopping, which I'm excited for. So I'm going to do some Christmas shopping and hopefully pick up some good bits. So I thought I'd take you along with me because I love going So we're just on the train on the way and they are so cute. They have the little goodie bag with little drink and like brownie and stuff in there. Um, so we're just with the girls have a little bit of a daily chat before we get there. Have some brunch. So this is like the perfect little service and they put us they put the cover down because oh, it's yeah, so cold. Yeah. So we're loving it. And then really, really cozy. This is the car in front. <laughs> Hi guys! The new cafe pop-up. It is so cute. It's like all pink. They've got a little outdoor bit, so we're gonna have a bit of brunch here. But this is such a cute little pop-up. Here she is. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome! <laughs> I love it. Oh, wait, wait, come here, come here. Come here, come here. You crack me. <laughs> oh my god, it's really bad. <laughs> You're good entertainment, girl. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So we've just had a little sandwich and a hot chocolate. It was so good, the white hot chocolate. If you come here, you need to try it. It's amazing. Al's on her like second coffee. <laughs> um, but I'm just, yeah, but I'm so ready now to go and shop. I'm like eagerly waiting. So I went in the shop. What's the first brand you're gonna want to go to? I kind of want to go to Gucci. They've got a big shop. Yeah, I want to see if they've got the yeah, time, so, so I've just left the girls and I'm heading to the top of Vista because I always feel like it's good to start at the top and then just make your way down and if I remember rightly, why are sellers up here, so I'll see what I can get because I remember last time, if you guys saw my last video, I managed to get the YSL trainers um, for really good buy, so I'll see what I can get. I saw the bag I got last time but there wasn't anything really like new in there and then I've been in Prada and I saw one I really like so I think I got a clip of it I'll put it on the screen and I'm kind of like um and ah and if to get it and then I've also been in Sandro and seen a coat for Chris that I might get him for Christmas but I'm currently just stood outside of Saint Laurent so I'm gonna go see what they have in here I'm just in Max Mara and I've tried on this coat obviously I've just put it on real quick but how amazing is it Obviously I'll tie it tight and it's got this like fringe detailing. I feel like Al inspired me because she had a black teddy one and it had all this fringe in. But this coat is literally amazing. Love it. It's like over a thousand and I just don't think I can justify it right now, but so I went in YSL and I saw actually a really nice bag. It was, I think it was 1,080. Um, it's kind of like a nude colour. I feel like I keep going for these nude colours. And then I've just gone into Dior. There wasn't anything crazy that I liked, but I have just seen the white company. As you guys know, I love home stuff. So I'm going to get some really cute Christmas things and hopefully get some nice baubles for the tree. So I've been looking online and I've seen so many nice little things. And they do these little houses. I'm going to see if they've got them. I'll show you inside. these PJs in the white company and I'm just thinking do I really need them but look how cute they are and they're such nice material and they've actually just been reduced to £20 so I'm thinking to maybe get these I know I have so many pyjamas but these are really sweet for maybe Christmas day from 
Vista and in a completely different outfit which I'll link down below as well as the outfit that I wore to Vista and that's basically because I realised my stupid self I've deleted loads of footage that I filmed when I left Vista like showing you what I got so I went down to sit and edit this video, realised I deleted it, so I'm sitting down now to actually show you what I got from Vista because I think the last time I spoke on the video I had come out of YSL and I was like oh and ahhing with what to get and I hadn't really picked up much but I did get a lot of presents whilst I was there which I'm thankful for because whenever I go shopping I always just seem to buy for myself whereas this time I was like no, get presents first and then treat myself after so fail <laughs> so I got this from the white company this is actually for my sister and she never watches my vlogs well that I know of anyway so hopefully she doesn't watch this one um, before Christmas and I got her this little set it's called the collection if it focuses sorry the lighting is so bad it just got so dark here so quickly today um, and this actually has the wild blackberry the Seville, Mustique and Peony and it's like four little candles so I thought this would be really cute in her little house because she lives in the Cotswolds and I'm going up this weekend so I'm going to make sure she gets that Christmas present ready and then I'm also getting her some beauty bits as well but obviously I didn't get them from Vista and I managed to get loads of Chris's presents from Vista which is great like he wanted this jacket for ages he already knows about this and I know he watches my videos so he won't mind me saying he's wanted this jacket from Sandro for ages and I managed to find it I actually saw it sent him a picture and then I went away and was like doing some other shopping came back and it had sold like it had gone so quickly but thankfully they had another jacket that he really liked so I managed to get that for him at a really good price um so I'm excited to give him that on Christmas and obviously I've got him loads of other little bits but I'm not sharing that on this video because I don't want to spoil it for him but the main one for this video that I wanted to show you was what I treated myself to which is <laughs> I went for the Saint Laurent so I obviously couldn't video when I was in the store the man was being like literally following me around like don't video don't take pictures which was a bit annoying because like when you're shopping obviously you want to take pictures like send to people like ask them what they think and their opinion as well because obviously when I was shopping on my own I wanted like a second opinion so thankfully I managed to sneak in some pics and send to my friend Amy and she was like helping me out and I ended up going with this bag and I'm so glad I actually treated myself because I kind of want to make it tradition now like on my birthday and Christmas I just want to treat myself to a little something obviously I'd save money aside this wasn't just like a crazy splurge but I'm not gonna lie I am I am kind of like an impulse buyer which is probably not a good trait but hey ho we need to treat ourselves sometimes and if I'm sounding a bit like croaky and like bunged up, it's because I've literally been suffering with the flu for the past few days. So I'm trying to power through because I wanted to get this video up to show you because I'm going to be posting wearing this bag a lot over the next few days. So I'm sure you'll see it over on my Instagram too, which is at all Chloe Rose if you're not following me. But are you ready for this? I feel like it looks a little wonky there. This is my new baby and I am honestly so happy I went with this one. So I couldn't decide between the black or this one. And this is kind of like, it says top, but I see it's like, um, it's like a dark cream, kind of like mushroom colour. And then it's got the gold details, which I love because I literally always wear gold jewellery. And then obviously it's got the... Saint Laurent little classic tag as well and I just think this will literally match with everything in my wardrobe and it's kind of that bag that won't just be for winter like I can wear this in the summer with like a really cute little white dress and stuff and it's the perfect size for me so you can wear it obviously like a handbag like this and then it's also got the strap inside so you can wear it like crossbody like this i will show you the picture of me wearing it like crossbody in the store which i managed to sneakily snap but honestly i'm so happy with this i was like i'm gonna and go around the shops i couldn't decide because i also saw the prada one which i think i still have the picture of so i'll put it on the screen um because i thought that was a really good buy too i think they were pretty much similar in price this was 830 pound and I think the Prada was maybe like 750, something around that bracket. But this was definitely 830. And the black one was 850 because the black was a bit more like boxier. So when I saw this, I was like, I love it. I just wish it was a bit more boxier because as you can see, this is kind of like soft, um, 
leather whereas the black one has more shape to it however the guy in the store because I was being so indecisive when it was in there he was so lovely and he was like look the black bag we get in like every two weeks sometimes we get it in like every other day and it sells a lot more than this one does and this one's kind of like a one-off like he was saying I don't think we'll get it back in like it's very unique the color of it um, so I'm always about getting a bag that no one else has got so hopefully not many people have this one and I just really like it I think it is just so me like you know when you see a bag and you're like yes I can see myself using that every day and especially the size of it and it's got really good space inside so I've actually already been using it so it's got a little pocket here and then it's just got a massive space inside um, it's kind of like suede so I've got to make sure I don't put lots of makeup in there and get it dirty but I'm honestly just so happy with this purchase and £830 is obviously a lot to spend but it's Christmas time and I'm literally at being my own Santa and treating myself. So I will try to find a link for this bag if I can and I will link it down below but Bisto at the minute it was really good actually the shops were. I managed to get loads of my Christmas presents like I said and there was really nice bags in Chloe but I've already got a Chloe bag. If you watch my last Bisto village you'll see when I got that. And I love the fact that I've got a YSL because I know it will just never go out of date. It will just never lose like its trademark. I absolutely love the brand. I think it's so classy and authentic. So yeah, that was my little purchase. So I thought I'd share it with you guys. And hopefully you liked this video. I remember next time to not delete the footage. Because um, I obviously did film a lot more. So this video will probably be a lot shorter than I expected. But hey ho, I hope you enjoyed it anyway. And if you did, please give it a like. And remember to hit subscribe because I'm going to be coming back on Sunday with my next video which will be part of Vlogmas. So stay tuned for that and until next time guys I will see you then.